Hello everyone, and welcome to A Slice with Strife. I'm William Strife, and this is a bird story. This is a uh, small indie game. It's made by the same person, or maybe people. I think it's only one guy, um, who made a game called To the Moon a couple of years back. Now, To the Moon was a game that I wanted to play, but I never really got around to. Uh, it had a lot of really fantastic uh, reviews and whatnot. But, you know, I just couldn't find the time, and I, I, I feel bad about that still. So, whenever I uh, heard about a bird story here, and found out that it's from the same person, I was like, okay, well this I, I really do need to look into. So, uh, I'm gonna start a new game. I've already played a bit. Uh, we're gonna start right here at the beginning. Uh, I don't need a mouse pointer. This is a, uh, it's a narrative-driven game. What do we have here? He's looking into the bush. What is he? Got some birds flying off. I really love the art in this game. It's, it's so nice. It's, uh, it's classic, it's retro, but at the same time, it's... It's charming. It's also got a really good soundtrack to it. Through a paper airplane. Uh, what's interesting about this game is that it's narrative driven, but it there's no actual narration. In fact, there's no there are no words, there are no letters, there's no story that's, like, written out or told to you. So, that's really, really nice. So, off to bed. Off with the light. There are the birds flying over the forest. Tossing and turning. Restless night's sleep. I've had nights like those, they're not fun. The time just goes by. Right. Well, I'm trying to go forward, but... I'm trying to go forward, but I keep getting that after image. So I guess I can only go back? Oh, I must be going back in time. Yeah, those clocks are moving backwards. They're not moving forward. Paper airplane. What? I mean, despite the fact that I've played some of this already, um, it's still not making an inherently large amount of sense to me. But I'm, I'm, I'm starting to pick up on it a little bit more this time around. Why are the lights turning off? And I merge into myself. Before we know it, uh, the clock tower? And I'm in class. I hate that sound of s s chalk on a chalkboard. It's oh my god! It's making my skin crawl. It's 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 a sound that's like really a pet peeve of mine. It makes me want to rip the chalkboard off the wall and, like, smash it with a sledgehammer or something? Ugh. Yes. Fingernails on chalkboard. Fingernails on chalkboard. Oh, he's looking out the window. Or at least I think he is. What's this? Oh. 
Hey, you stole my paper airplane. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. Oh. 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 Oh, hey, take a look at the equation. Something equals cat. The squared root of something it would look like to me. Uh. So am I sent to the office? Or, oh. Okay, no, I guess I'm just in the hallway for punishment. Okay. Bunch of other kids. Silhouettes of kids. Uh... Oh. Uh... Let's keep going. Oh. She's still screaming at me. <laughs> Whatever, I'm gonna keep going. Get away from the teacher! The lockers have treetops. This makes all the sense in the world. Oh, hey. I'm not at the playground. Looks like me. Oh, the seesaw is a two-person... Don't seem to have a lot of friends. I'm gonna keep going then. None of the others have fun with me. I guess I'm going home? Man, I really like the way that this game sounds and feels. There's actually something... Like, I, I, I get it, there's a story. And stuff is... It's happening, you know? I don't really know what I'm trying to say. The, the, the point is, is... This is good. Okay, so I'm in an apartment complex. And, uh... Pop into the elevator. Awkward ride. Um... What was that? Ugh. Those long... corridors. You got some rats in the... <laughs> Not the best kept place. Seems to be a problem with the lighting as well. Home again, home again. Ah, lights are on. Now, I don't know about you, but uh, I don't have a lot of experience with floor lights being connected to a uh, light switch. What's this? Uh, it must be a letter from mom or dad. Dinner's in the fridge. Love you much. Man, being a latchkey kid sucks. Can I, uh... Ooh, I can. And then... I can shut it off from the light. Okay. Huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, that's being a kid, all right. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's shut off this light. That's probably Mom and Dad's room. Ah, this would be my room. Ah, turn it on. There we go. Chuck the backpack in the corner. And, uh... Ooh, no time for homework. Time for food. I mean, uh, I remember that. It, it was, like, 
absolutely necessary. You get home from school and you've got to get something to eat because you're starving. Uh, maybe you were like me and uh, you skipped lunch in high school because, you know, you didn't have a job and you used your the lunch money to buy stuff. Uh, you know, save it. Or, uh, or maybe you're like me whenever I was, like, you know, in, uh, in middle school or elementary school, where it just didn't matter how much you ate, you were always hungry. Who? Okay, on to the homework, I guess. I hope that's not a textbook, ripping a page out of your textbook. Well, it's not that anybody would really notice. <laughs> Fun with the paper airplane. Oh. Ow. Tripped. Mm. Man, that would hurt the nose. <laughs> Keep at it with the studies. I was looking a little bit tired there. Before you know it, it's the middle of the night. Yeah. I remember days like that. I mean, I'll, I'll be honest, but I didn't fall asleep at my desk, and for that matter, I... Even though, um... Mom and Dad weren't always home. I, I wasn't exactly a, a latchkey kid, so... Oh, someone put a blanket on him. I figure that's what it was that happened anyway. Ooh, it's the morning. Oh, God. Those... Ugh. One of those things. <laughs> yeah, that's about what I would do. Good morning, world. I don't want to be awake right now. <laughs> oh. I just realized that he's got the blanket on him. Okay. Oh, he threw it on the bed. And now he's brushing his teeth. Seems a pretty standard affair. Yep. That groggy morning. So, just go straight for to school? No? Uh... I'm gonna go to school, I might want to grab my backpack. I don't want to forget my homework either. Even though I've been drawing the whole time instead of actually working. Nothing about the pile of papers. And, of course, gotta get something before... Now, personally, I would eat before brushing my teeth. Muffins. <laughs> Health bar. What have we got here? Uh, something about rain. I might want to take that with me. Oh, come on. You shouldn't ignore the advice there. Ooh. Watch the watch where you're going, kid. You're dangerous. You don't get it run over. Oh, that's a <laughs> that's a really neat way of showing that I'm getting back to school really fast. <laughs> Not enough sleep last night. <laughs> For such a simply designed game, there's a lot of character in this. And it's very uncommon that you can get something with so much narrative without any actual speaking. Or text. What's good? Uh-oh. Take me to task over it? Oh! That is one violent teacher! Well, I... Well, I 
to... I know exactly what the deal is. I mean, I've had violent teachers like that in my past that just... They really, really had a problem with the fact that they had to deal with kids all day. So they... They gave you no quarter. Didn't matter if you were a good student or not. And there you go, it's raining. You should have taken the frickin' umbrella with you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, check me out. I'm jumping across across the playground. Wet in the puddles. Whee! Good times, eh? Although, if I'm completely honest, I'd probably be a little bit more concerned with getting uh, soaked wet. I mean, what the heck is that noise? The trees are moving for me. What the heck? Oh. Oh, look. I th is that a badger? Doesn't seem to have any rabies. What the heck was it chasing? Was it a mouse? No, it's a bird. Huh. Well, of course it's a bird. This is called a bird story. Okay. Oh! Only one wing is working. It's injured. That's why it was getting chased. Okay, I guess I... Can I... No, no, okay. I'm gonna leave it alone. What? Oh no, it's getting chased again. Oh no. Woo, chucked a rock at it. Er, oh no, that's my backpack. <laughs> oh wow. So, doesn't realize yet. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, th there goes the tree. Moving back and forth again. What the... Oh, I get it. This is this is showing that, like, I'm taking a different path somewhere else. Man, I really love the way that this game is... What it's managing to do with so little. Um, oh, it's a vet clinic. Well, guys, um, this has been a bird story with me, William Strife. I I'm out of time for recording right now. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, hopefully, you're, uh, you're interested enough to go back... And, uh, you know, pick this game up yourself off Steam. It's really cheap, and uh, it's it's obviously great. Uh, absolutely worth uh, playing through. I uh, don't know that I will actually go back and finish this. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Uh, the recording for this is a little bit awkward. It doesn't like to cooperate with Fraps too much. Um, but uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys check this out yourself. If you really want me to play through the rest of this, uh, and, you know, enough if enough of you are tuning in, uh, let me know. Uh, otherwise, I will see all of you later. Bye!